Hey, what's up, you guys? WWE fan 0599 here again, and today we're going to review episode 21 of season 3 of Arrow. And this episode is entitled, I'm going to do my best to pronounce this, Asa. I saw him. I, I, I'm sorry if I butchered that, but yeah, what this episode is basically about, it's about, you know, Oliver is now, he's no longer Oliver. He's that name that I just mentioned, I'm not going to repeat it again. And, you know, Raz has just brainwashed him. And now what happens is, is that, you know, uh, he sends Asahim, whatever he's called, I'm just calling him Oliver, he sends Oliver to go and get Nessa, and, you know, to kill her, basically. Oh yeah, spoilers. So, what I think of this episode. It was a good episode, you know, it wasn't great, but it was still good. I still enjoyed it. I enjoyed this episode. So let's get into my positives, and my positives are, you know, I really liked, I think... This is one of the best episodes I've seen Stephen Amell act in because, you know, he's playing this guy that is now brain, that is, you know, not himself anymore. He is a completely different person. In the intro of the show, he's even like, my name what was Oliver Queen. Like, he is a different person now. This is no longer Oliver Queen, you know, so I really liked how he, you know, seeing Oliver in this episode, you know, as a completely different person. He doesn't care anymore. You know, he's just a completely different person. I like seeing that in this episode. I also liked kind of the sort of friendship that Laurel and Nessa have together. You know, I did like seeing them when they were at the diner and they were eating burgers. And she was like, dip, dip your french, french fry in the uh, shake. I did like that. I think this is the best I've seen Laurel in any episode. I did, I did think her back and forth with Nessa was good, I think. This is the best I've seen Laurel in, in the series overall. I did love the action, especially the last one where, you know, uh, I don't want to jump too far ahead, but uh, when Oliver captures uh, Diggle's wife, I forgot her name. I did like when Oliver and everybody, they start fighting, like, it was just great. I did like that final action scene, and, you know, Thea puts an arrow through Oliver, and she's like, go, go. We'll get into more of that into my negatives, but uh, the writing was pretty good with this episode. I did like the writing. The directing was pretty good. I did like the directing with this episode. My negatives with this episode would have to be the first one. Like I was just mentioning, I don't like how all of a sudden Thea... Can just all of a sudden become a bone arrow like expert or whatever. I know she's had tons of training and everything, but but when she's telling Oliver to go, like, and Oliver's doing nothing about it, I felt like Oliver should have fought back or something. But no, I, I just felt like you're building this character up as you know the next Raz Al Ghul. He's going to be you know you know the heir to the demon, and he's following commands from. Thea to go. What? Like, are, are you serious? I, I did not like that. I thought that was kind of silly in my opinion. My next negative would have to be the flashbacks. The flashbacks, I could care less this episode. I really did. Only thing I did, you know, like seeing from the flashbacks is when Mosetu and his wife uh, get into the car with Oliver, her blood comes out of the son's mouth. And my prediction was right. If you go back to, I believe my, I believe the Left Behind review, I did say that maybe the reason the the two are split, they split up is because maybe their son died or whatever. I made that prediction. And it does look like it. That's going to happen. So yeah. Besides that, the flashbacks I couldn't really care about in this episode. My final negative would have to be. Felicity. I felt like Felicity was annoying in this episode. I do what are they doing with this character? She they're making her annoying. Please don't. Don't. I just felt like she was just annoying. She was like, Oliver wouldn't do that. Woman, he is brainwashed. He is brainwashed by the League of, of Assassins. So it's time for my official grade on episode twenty one, and my official grade on episode twenty one is a B plus. I did enjoy this episode. It was a very, it was a good episode in my opinion, so it's getting a B plus. So what did you guys think of this episode? Leave it in the comment section below. Two more episodes, guys. 
two more episodes and we're done with the season. So, le leave it in the comment section below. And I'm WWE Fan 0599 and we'll see you all later. Peace.